for the moment, they're sticking to their ground. No renegotiation. That's the line. That's been the firm line. I mean, the prelude to all this, Francine, was that about two weeks ago, Der Spiegel reported that Angela Merkel could live and was making contingency plannings for a Greek exit from the euro. Now, they walked that report back a little bit. Last night, what we got from the finance ministry was a very clear line saying the agreement reached with Greece remains valid. This morning, all throughout the morning talk shows, also local newspaper interviews, there is a great uh, sort of emphasis being put on Greece needing to stay with the bailout program. They're saying that they need to continue to pay back debt. And you look at the bill. This is sort of the mass market tabloid here. They had a, they went big, they went splashy with it. There's a great deal of concern, and it's reflected in the German popular opinion. 68% of Germans do not favor, oppose a debt restructuring. Build is really whipping up the uh, sort of anti-austerity sentiment, or anti-anti-austerity, I should say, and they're really leading this charge. It's going to be interesting to see whether or not Merkel and her finance minister Schäuble can keep the German public with them, or whether or not the German public will simply be driving this. And if the German public is driving it, it's going to be no renegotiation, no haircut, no change in maturities. There's a very hard line, it seems, at least in the public press. Francine? Yeah, and Hans, what's the ECB stance? You just told us, of course, what, what the German uh, central bank thinks. Yeah. Is there any room for the ECB to act as pressure valve if the EU can't find a political solution? So what the EU has said, or this is, this is Mr. Benoit Cour, he gave an interview at Handelsblatt this morning. It's always fascinating that a lot of these interviews take place in German language media. But his interview in Handelsblatt was saying there needs to be a political solution that the ECB, even though they're a member of the Troika, uh, the ECB cannot by itself cancel or restructure any of the debt that you need to have. It would just be legally impossible. So the ECB, at least Frankfurt side of things, is firmly putting the ball back in Brussels court. They, of course, had that finance minister's meeting at 3.30 today. And then in just a couple of hours, a couple of minutes, really, later on this hour, we'll get reaction from the German government officially. Maybe we can tease a little bit more out of them of what they think about what this new coalition government in Athens is going to look like. Francine? All right, Hans, thank you so much. Hans Nichols there with the German and ECB reaction.